Hey Shannon, Ed and I were able to uh, mark off the spot that is leaking uh, back there on the back side of City Trim. We're able to pull exact measurements up here and came just about directly overhead this hole. This is literally a hole, whereas you have these stretch cracks or stress cracks all the way across this roof that are all allowing a little bit of water in, no doubt. Um, but again, this one right here is just about right in line with the uh, leak that we're seeing inside. So what I'll go ahead and propose that we do, and I'm not seeing anything else as bad as this one, just your standard cracks like these. Um, I'll just propose that we pull five feet in either direction of that mark right there and use this same silicone based system and um, pressure wash it real good, allow it to dry thoroughly and then coat it out. Um, and that should take care of this, this one particular leak. But again, I just want to stress the importance of this entire roof. It's about to be too far gone to be able to recover it. And then when that happens and this insulation board underneath this membrane starts taking on too much moisture, this whole entire system will have to be torn off and a whole new um, roof put on because it will be to um, it, it won't be able to be recovered at that point it's just gonna have too much moisture in there all right Shannon thanks for your time hope this video is helpful